Second runner-up of the essay competition, organized by the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Crimes Commission, has urged Nigerian youth to be actively involved in the fight against corruption in the country. She gave the advice at the presentation of prizes to winners of ICPC 20th Anniversary Essay and Music Competitions in Ibadan. My advice for youth that are upcoming is that they should be humble and full of integrity. Then they should be part of people who fight against corruption in the country. In his address, at the presentation of the prizes, ICPC chairman, represented by Honorable Abdullah Said, said that the competition was organized to inculcate sound moral values in young Nigerians. According to him, a 48-year-old police officer has emerged as one of the winners of the Public Service Integrity Award organized by the Commission as part of activities to commemorate its 20th anniversary. In the case of the Public Service Integrity Award, the Commission has sought for entries from Ministry, Department and Agency through the Office of the Secretary to the Government of the Federation and the Office of the Head of Service and the Civil Service of the Federation and 17 public servants of integrity were nominated. The ICPC 20th Anniversary Committee shortlisted the nomination to only five and background checks were conducted on, their, on them including obtaining testimonies of community and religious leaders about them. At the end of this exercise, 54 years old Marlon Hamza Adamu Boai of the National Boundary Commission and 48 years old Chief Superintendent of Police Francis Osaidi Arago, DPO, D Division, Itam, Uyu, Akwaeba State, emerged the overall winner. The two icons of integrity had at various times turned down bribes, offers, and frustrated efforts by unfortunate elements in the public service to siphon public funds, thereby preventing the perpetration of havoc that will have affected the economic and the society negatively. Violence before, we stand against corruption.